Could you imagine going from this to this to this? There are tingles up and down my spine. Hello there everyone, Koniki D here, welcome back to another video. So today, I am here with these brand new maps that are on the screen right now, designed by Felipe Sims on Devian Art, but he posted them on Twitter and everybody went psycho for them. So, we are going to start, before we see those, see where the Sims 4 maps originated from, that includes Willow Creek and Oasis Springs, and see where they could go with his brand new maps that he created. First, we're gonna start with the very origin of the game itself. Back on the first day it launched, we got this ugly thing. Um, now, these aren't the actual houses that were in the world. This is just a picture I found on Google. But I personally, well, first of all, I thought it was cool when it first came out. But now with the world that we have, this thing is ugly. The fact that they grayed out the lots and only let you hover over a certain neighborhood at a time, I don't know what they were thinking. But I am so glad that they uploaded it, updated it. I mean, so glad they updated it it is way better now but you know this is where we all started i thought we should take us back give us some classical music um and just see where we first started but now let's get into like what we have today which is significantly better we have this amazing world map that i personally do love i love the styles of the world maps this is one of my favorites brindleton bay was a little bit too further out and not as colorful this one is bright colorful it has a lot of lots it's a classic it's just so nice and cool and fresh and just everything you need in a base game world willow creek had with the water and the steamboat and just like the surrounding houses and areas it's just all so crazy and then we go to this beauty absolutely beautiful the water i mean even though this is not the style of the sims 4 just having the world maps like this would make it, it is just amazing the houses on the bottom right the steamboat the way the water looks and the different colors the texture that the land has still keeping the cherry blossom trees including like every single dock and like park you see like next to the park there's that little dock there the fishing pier which is exactly how it is in the game the palm trees that are off to the side on the left just the wind blowing all the different streams and ponds and fake houses that we'll never actually get i just love every single bit of this i don't know how else to explain it i wish i hope that one day some mod creator will let me be able to put this in my game because the minute that is allowed, I'm doing it. And I hope that one day we can get Creator Worlds, even though SimGuru K kind of confirmed that in this new update that we're going to get, we won't be getting it, but one day we might be getting it. And that another mod creator is working on Creator World and creating his own world, and we might get it soon. I don't really know, but this is just so amazing. Let's move on to see the even greater oasis springs and we're back with our 1920s ballpark music to look at what oasis springs once was another good base game town shocked us all that there were two worlds in the base game i know two count them two this is kind of even more updated than the other one because you can actually see the colors on the lot but really it started off and it was all white and when you saw it it was just gross dirt um so that's the difference there um i did not like this map at all i didn't play in it when the first when it first came out but you know what we were all just happy to see that there were two different worlds in the game but you know what Th this just i mean it just doesn't work it doesn't capture the real beauty of oasis springs which we somewhat got in the next updated version this one that we have today i love the colors in this um in this map because once again it is bright and it really does just capture what oasis brings in is which is just a desert world you know just pretty casual i love all the water everything that's there all like the you know the very faint trees very nice but however look at this beauty I, 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 speechless absolutely freaking speechless how is this not the best thing you've ever seen a much more accurate i must say depiction of oasis springs because the bottom left corner with 
the the whole area there with the little you see like the little steel in the very bottom left corner and the air the pond and like that kind of weird boardwalk that they got going there and just that lot there and then the more green area right above it with the fancy houses and those houses off to the top left and then we go all the way to the bottom right and you see the dirtiness of those houses over there and the grass in that neighborhood and then the rock work and all like the, the weird little ponds that are there and the big river that is round and the train track and the rock work and just the radio tower and all of the trees that are in oasis springs even the ones that line the streets they're all there this one oh my gosh is absolutely beautiful i hope one day they will let me put this in the game because i just cannot with this i, I love it so much if you guys love these as much as i do please leave a big thumbs up and go follow felipe sims on twitter i'll leave his links down below he's just too amazing not to want to go look at his stuff every five minutes every single world that i look at is usually by him or has a palm bob it's just i love them so much but that is it thank you guys for watching this video hopefully he will release more so i can keep doing these because these are so much fun to look at what once was and to see how we could have it in the future but that is it i hope you guys enjoyed if you did, please like this big i'll see you guys all again next time goodbye Woo.